guess what's going on in the world of hip hop? Murder or or killing for that matter. It's, Who? It's, a, it's a very strong word, and uh, you know, by two chains own admittance, he killed Kanye West, Big Sean, and Pusha T on the song Mercy. Now, now, where did this come from? Uh, basically, there was a uh, you know Instagram um, you know post that was floating around yesterday, and uh, it said everyone bodied this track, but who had the best verse? And Two Chains posted over that. No disrespect, but I killed all them boys. And, and just oh. in case we we need to see the exhibit in which we're talking about, yeah. uh, here, here is Two Chains' verse from Mercy, which is uh which is very extravagant. Take a listen. Now catch up to my campaign. Cool to call oh. my mayonnaise. I'm drunk and hot at the same time. Drinking champagne Ooh. on the airplane. Oh, yeah, I'm rounds like a gun range. Bye. Beat it up like rampage. Honey bands. Cut your girl now. Your girl need a band aid. Great A. A1. Chain the color Acon. Black diamonds, backpack rhyming. Co signing by Louis Vuitton. Yeah. Horsepower, horsepower. All this polo on. I got horsepower. Pound this cost 4000 I make it rain. She want more showers. Rain. Right. Right. Pouring. All right. I mean, he did ah. kill it. He killed it. But he, I mean, he got busy. You know, in my head, I everyone. always went back and forth between who, like, you know, went harder. Was it him or Kanye West? Now, technically, Kanye West cheated because he had, like, the beat switch up before he started rhyming. You know, but it was very provocative. You know, Can we get a refresher? Can we get uh, a I didn't, I didn't that suicide part out. does that. I threw suicide to that song. Oh. I threw suicide that's, on a private jet. It's been a minute since I actually yeah. listened, listened to that song. But damn, that verse was hot, though. He, he killed yo, it. Yo, I mean, like, yo, he Two Chains it. verses are always very visual. But I, my I favorite my favorite line that Kanye had, though, was, brothers be law and to feel important. You gonna see lawyers in, in, with Jordans. It's just yeah. such a visual. Like, yo, there's gonna be, like, mad dudes in suits and some people wearing Jordans in the lobby of your your place of uh, where you stay. I, yeah. I love it. Yeah. Two Chains be having a lot of sneaky murders because even that song with him and, and Drake, I feel like he killed Drake on that song. Drunk and, is it Drunk and High? And then, uh, oh, both. Both, both yeah. Both. Nope. And everybody, you know, Drake is Drake so everybody naturally assume that but I feel like Two Chains took him on that song. Yeah, nah, 2 Chains is a rapper's rapper, and if you're not careful, he will smoke you in front of all your fans yeah. on your record. But uh, I digress. Smoker. Moving on, another hip-hop news. Uh, a miracle happened yesterday, and it will say, uh, I don't know whether, like, if there's like a, a religious holiday connection to like the Thursday before uh, you know, Good Friday, but... Uh, they, they brought back quarantine radio yesterday. Can we get a round of applause for that, ladies? I don't gentlemen? think that has quarantine, anything quarantine, at all to do with Jesus. Really? Quarantine. Not, but it was no, a miracle. Not at all. It was a miracle be, because here's the thing: Tory Lanez <laughs> wanted to promote his brand new project, New Toronto Three, which is out right now. And the little skimming that I did, the project is phenomenal, okay, super I'm phenomenal. All right? he did his thing on that. Big shout to Tory Lanez. But okay. uh, yo, he was very, very cautious, and he was telling people to yo, whatever you do, don't get naked, get creative. And people were getting creative. And that chick that got him kicked off last time that was eating a human-sized gummy worm, uh, she had that gummy worm, like, you know, wrapped in plastic because she was being careful this time. And then she Ooh. came on later Are one way and entire... Are you serious? No, I'm dead serious. She came dead back serious. again? She came back again, but, like, this time she had the, the gummy worm thing wrapped in plastic. And then she came on at the end of the broadcast, and she was wearing, like, a full, like, nuclear hazmat suit <laughs> just so there would be no nudity on her behalf again. They were very cautious and very careful. And somehow, <laughs> out of the pits of hell, they ended up finding Alexis, Texas. Don't look her up. And yes. she also twerked. Is that Alexis on... Guy's cousin from Texas? No. No, no, no. 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 Six, no. 625 adult films, guys. 625. Wow. Wait Alexis a minute. Te I, that means you had sex with at least that many people. Well, yeah. sometimes they work with the same people, but I digress. Yeah. So big shout out to Tory Lanez for being back with Quarantine, Quarantine, Quarantine. It was super dope. And be sure you check out New Toronto 3, which is out right now. And last but not least, man, uh, you know, we got sent some prayers in the air one time for rapper uh, Fred the Godson. We talked about him and his uh, coronavirus, uh, you know, uh, you know how he got it. And, uh, you know, his uh, wife is saying, like, hey, he's in there fighting for his life. You know, uh, the doctors already weaned him down from 100%, uh, you know, use of a ventilator to about 40%. So that is a big, major improvement, man. So uh, continued uh, recovery and continued speed, brother. Uh, get through this. And everybody out there, like I said, don't move around if you don't got to, man. That's it for me. For this okay. other stories, I'm following Twitter, Instagram, and SoundCloud, H-E-A-D-K-R-A-C-K. We are the morning hustle.